Good evening, James Dibble with the national news from the ABC. There was a time when news was a noble trade, built on a foundation of journalistic integrity. But then it became salacious and just plain stupid. Police confront a man with more pussy than he knows what to do with. All thanks to one visionary news team. Good evening. Tonight's top story is... Crack. I understand we have some crack, and we're going to smoke it right here in the studio. Oh, whoa, whoa. You feel that right away. Oh. It's just refreshing. Mr. Burgundy, you are the worst anchor man I have ever seen. Aren't you the guy who lost his job to his wife? Tonight, I interview Yasser Arafat. Why do we have to tell the people what they need to hear? Why can't the news be fun? Yay! While some experts say silicone breast implants are dangerous, I say bring on the fun bags. Our ratings went through the roof. Turn it off! You're a success! You're not black or Asian. What are you? I'm gay. Do you sleep in a coffin? No, that's vampires. Are you allowed to be out in the sun? Those are also vampires. Are you a vampire? No, I'm gay. Who's hungry for some Jimmy Chonkas? Best thing I ever did was install this deep fryer in the bago. Hey, who's driving? It's OK. It's on cruise control. <laughs> he says we're all going to die. Oh, no! Where's my map? Look at the monitor. Yeah. Uh, where's my legs? I don't have any legs, Ron. <laughs> Rick, it's because you're wearing green pants. Ah! <laughs> In 93! No. Rick? In 93! <laughs> don't stop. I have a date. We need to get you a little protection. Brian Fantana's world famous Jimmy Cabinet. See any you like? The responsible pirate. Leave it to Beaver. I know, Brian. What about the hooded guest? I've had four of my seven illegitimate children using this condom. But, Brian, isn't that the whole point of wearing a condom? To not impregnate the woman? Well, you know the old expression. Nope. 